So today we're going to look at a PDF file. Uh, this is going to be a super quick analysis. Uh, you'll see why here in a second. But here's our PDF. If we throw that into PE Studio real quick, see the virus total has a couple of hits on it. Strings, quite a bit because it's a PDF file. If we go ahead and throw this into PDF Stream Dumper. We can go ahead and start looking through all the streams. Uh, right now this one looks a little full of information so we can scroll down to the bottom here and then we see a very odd URL so we can copy that out um, and all the other sections they don't really have much in them uh, already looked through them but uh, you just want to look for odd things especially URLs um, you can also use the PDF Stream Dumper's uh, exploit scan, and it'll look for all kinds of exploits. For instance, all of these. So it looks for these common exploits within PDF documents. Uh, this particular document doesn't have any of those. You'll see that here in a second. But when we open up the PDF, this is what we get. A blurred image with uh, some writing up here probably telling us to go ahead and click the link. In the link, you can see it hovering right here, the safe.09, and we already found that within the document. So if we click that, ask if we want to allow it, sure, go ahead. And we see that it brings up a browser and it tries to download this PDF right here. So this will probably be a stage two attack. Um, the next PDF, the one it's trying to download, may have some sort of exploit in it, or another link, or who knows. Um, but that's it. Uh, that's just a super quick way to get a uh, URL out of the PDF document and kind of follow it down the rabbit hole. In this case, it looks like this site has already been taken down, which is good. Uh, but if you all have any questions on analyzing PDF documents or any other malware, hit us up at ringzerolabs.com, and we'd be happy to help you out.